So a spread operator is used to expand the elements of an array or an object. So it's when you want to take items from one array or an object and add it to another. So you can have an example like this. Have one and two, and then this spread operators are three dots, and then you have the arr one, and then a comma, and then you have the three and four. So if you should output this, I'm going to get something like this. ARR2 is going to be equal to 1, 2, 3, 4. Without having to write all this, it does utilize the spread operator and then we have rest operator. So they are basically the same way of right typing them but then each have what they do operator so we have so with the rest operator it's used to collect multiple elements or properties okay and condense them into an array or an object so mostly when you don't know when when you don't know how much an argument properties will get or you want okay you don't know how much argument you want or properties you want to get then you can use the rest operator so an example is like this then the sum and yes so num and then the arrow function is to what make a callback method that reduce accumulator and current CRR and then we have our arrow function to make a callback ACC plus CRR With this over here, this guy with the three dots attached to num, okay, is going to do this. So this guy. Some yes into what an array called num so it's like it's 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 going to collect something it's going to let's say um 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 yes it's like a tax collector it's going to collect a tax okay and then display them in an array so this this sum with them arguments one two three four is the same as this sum with an array one two three four so these are the arguments we've collected into sum. So sum is equal to num, which num with the rest operator 
collected all the arguments in the sum over here into an array here okay so 